say to someone, if they said to you that I'm a New Testament Christian, I love Jesus, I just like to read the New Testament. The Old Testament, that's old, that's old covenant, that's older information. I just limit myself to reading the New Testament, that's where I'm at. How would you uh, respond to a statement like that? You know, we really do need to be reading the Old Testament. It's for our benefit to be reading this big section of God's Holy Word. In this short time, I'd like to just share three reasons why we need to be reading the Old Testament. They're not the only reasons, but just the time we have, let's limit ourselves to three. Number one, we need to read the Old Testament because it is foundational material. How many of us, if we we're reading a novel, would just dive straight in at page 205? How many of us would just go straight to chapter 11 and begin there? No, we, we start at the beginning because we realize there's a, there's a sequence and we understand later information better when it's in its context and we understand where it is in relation to what has gone before. And the same applies to the Bible. For example, uh, we understand a book like Hebrews better if we've read Leviticus. There are things in the book of Revelation we understand better if we've read the book of Daniel. So the Old Testament is really formative in helping us to have a correct worldview and then appreciating more what we find when we come to the New Testament. Just another example of that would be that if we want to study a topic, there is wisdom in going to the first mention of that topic. So if we wanted to do a study into God and who God is, or a study into who we are as human beings, or a study of marriage, or a study of where did sin come from, would be wise to go straight to the first three chapters of Genesis, where these are first mentioned. And that applies as a general rule that just look for where something first appears in the Bible, and then we better understand that concept. So that's one reason to read the Old Testament, just to lay a good foundation for our understanding of the whole Bible. The second reason to read the Old Testament is that it reveals the character of God. There are so many stories in the Old Testament that aren't just a great read, but they actually reveal God's character. When we look at God, you know, delivering Israel from Egypt and then his amazing provisions and deliverances uh, for them in the wilderness years, and then great victories during the times of the judges and the kings. Yet yeah, these really help to form our view of God and having a correct understanding of him and all his wonderful attributes. In the Old Testament, we see that God is powerful. We see that nothing is too hard for him. He's faithful. He's concerned about justice. We see that he has a heart for the widow and the orphan and the stranger. And we see that God is a God of love and mercy and grace. There are so many things about God that we learn through studying the Old Testament. And then we'll appreciate Jesus more because Jesus is Emmanuel, God with us. So if we first come to understand what God is like in the Old Testament, then we have a better appreciation that those characteristics are seen in God incarnate in the person of Jesus Christ. So we need to read the Old Testament to really grow in our understanding of God. A third reason to read the Old Testament is because of all the poetry and the wisdom literature it contains. All 150 Psalms in the Bible are all located in the Old Testament. Uh, I need the Psalms. Do you need the Psalms? Oh, the Psalms help us to survive in trials that we go through. Uh, I had a gentleman tell me a number of years ago that he went through a really distressing emotional time and the only part of the Bible he could read was the Psalms. That's where he was at in his Christian life and he got relief from the Psalms. The Psalms are like a glass of cool water on a hot day. And, and they really connect with us and we connect with them and, and the emotion in the Psalms. Not just to read the Psalms, but to pray the Psalms and to pray out our hurt and our frustration and confusion and even anger. Just to pray these things out to God by using the Psalms as like a, a guidebook for how to pray and how to approach God. Oh, we need the Psalms. We need the Proverbs, the wisdom literature, Ecclesiastes. So all these uh, poetic and um, wisdom literature books in the Old Testament, we'd be much the poorer if we limited ourselves to the New Testament and bypassed all there is to learn from them. So these are just three simple reasons. There are others, but just three reasons why it's so important that we read the Old Testament. May God encourage us to do this. And, and iron sharpens iron. We, we can encourage each other 
by sharing with one another what we've been learning to say to someone, look, I'm just loving reading Deuteronomy at the moment, or I'm learning so much from Proverbs, or I've just been so blessed from reading Malachi this week, and just be encouraging each other to be reading the Old Testament.